me how to do my best, learn to invest, and have a lot of fun doing it. Hit the Secret Millionaires Club. The Secret Millionaires. The Secret Millionaires Club. The Secret Millionaires Club. The best investment you can make is an investment in yourself. Please call the meeting to order. It's a perfect scale model, Radley. I'm sure you'll get an A in your architecture class. I won't get an A in phys ed if I don't get to practice. Let's get started. Very well. I hereby call this meeting to <laughs> Order. Oops, sorry, but my friend Sean has an urgent question. He sells collectibles at the flea market, and he has a chance to stock up on PowerBot cards really cheaply. PowerBot cards? Everybody loves these. I know, so he needs us to give him some advice. Should he spend all his money stocking up on PowerBot cards? There's certainly an established market for them. PowerBot cards sure are popular right now, but fads tend to come and go quickly. Hey, remember a couple of years ago when there was that fad for nose whistles? Yeah! Everywhere you went, kids were whistling through their noses. That was when Mr. Tibbetts, who owns the toy store downtown, invested in a huge supply of nose whistles. Then everybody found themselves annoyed by the pernicious din. And they got sick of the way they sounded. Oops! Um, that too. Exactly. So people stopped buying nose whistles. And Mr. Tibbetts had to sell them all for less than he paid for them. But kids are going to want PowerBot cards for a long time. Are you sure? Guessing wrong on trends can lead to trouble in business, especially when demand is based on fickle consumer sentiment. We'd better tell Sean to invest his money in something that will always be cool, like basketballs. Or at least something that will always be in demand. Hi, Elena. What did you tell your friend Sean? I told him not to spend all his money on PowerBot cards. And it's a good thing. They are so last week. Mr. Tippett's bought them all instead for his toy store. Hey, everybody. I got an A in my architecture class. Good going, Radley. It looks great. And I got extra credit for making it out of recycled material. What did you make it out of? Mr. Tippett's gave me a great price on PowerBot cards. Sounds like Mr. Tippett's didn't learn from his mistake. Remember. Learn from your mistakes, or better yet, learn from the mistakes of others. And now, here's words from Warren. Hey kids, Warren Buffett here. A business is difficult to judge if the supply and demand of a product is based on the fickle sentiment of consumers. You always want to invest in a business that is dependable and predictable. Otherwise, you can end up making a mistake. This is similar to making friends. If you are fickle and not reliable and dependable, people will never know how to judge you. So remember, always be reliable, consistently friendly to others, and learn from your mistakes. Better yet, learn from the mistakes of others. The best investment you can make is an investment in yourself. The more you learn, the more you'll learn.